All right, this is one of the hardest ones I've had so far to figure out who the person was. Um, this was tough. HeatherAnnChristensen.com. Here she is. There she is as well. 90% customer satisfaction, really shooting for the moon. And then a third photo. So those are the three photos we got to work with. None of them come up with a reverse image search except for this page. So that's tricky. But there were a couple clues and I was able to find this Facebook photo with this woman who looked pretty close. And then through there, I was able to find this Instagram page. And again, she, she looks pretty close. You scroll down though, and we find the exact photos. So here's that first photo. Oh, was that the only one I found? I thought I found more. Let's see if we can't find some more of them. Here's that next photo. And then the final one was her standing in the snow. There she is. Oh, her very first photo on this account. So this is not Heather Ann Christensen on heatherannchristensen.com. These are stolen photos. They stole them from the Instagram account of Realtor Renee YYC. And they are using these photos in combination with stolen credentials or fake credentials. I haven't actually looked into it, but they've used stolen or fake credentials plus a good picture to create a fake person who is going to trick you into going to a website. And on that website, it's going to look like a real brokerage, a real trading platform. They're going to get you to deposit crypto. And once you do so, that crypto is gone. So this is a crypto scam. Be wary of financial advisors on the internet that you're finding through YouTube comment chains. Uh, just be careful. There are victims to these scams and they lose real money. Just saw an article that said that $12.5 billion have been scammed away from Americans in 2023. So I know they're not all this type of scam, but this is a type of these scams. So you just need to be careful out there. Stay safe. Bye.